riding the trike without the trailer. Or the dogs. They are back at my sister's house. So this is kind of unusual for me to... It's much easier, of course, without all that weight. run over and get it and it's just uh, it's kind of strange because for six months it was non-stop other than taking a day to rest once a week every day was you know I've got to get to another city or another campground or another park or some place in the in the forest to camp. So it's I'm kind of decompressing, I guess, slowing down just to take a break, rest, uh, get organized. I've got so many things I need to do. Um, even with the trike. I'm the uh, the internal hub in the rear has been started to slip, and luckily I made it back to Phoenix before it went out. So I've got to probably take that apart and re, you know, maybe put in some new parts, repack the bearings, repack everything, just clean it all. Uh, same with the brakes. They are uh, probably need some new pads because I think they've worn down quite a bit. Some pretty crazy downhills, you know, where I had to ride the brakes uh, for many miles at a time. You know, I would usually try to uh, ride them a little bit, you know, slow down and then let off on the brakes. I didn't want to overheat them or anything but it is kind of strange to be back here in in uh, the Phoenix area I'm going to Einstein's which, like I said I've been craving for about six months Don't know if they'll recognize me there with this beard. I, the day that I left, I stopped at Einstein's that morning. And uh, it's kind of a going away thing as far as my last Einstein's. And so now I'm going back to have another one. It's going to take a little while to get used to not being out on the highway or out on the roads or Let's see there we go What do you think maybe there's an open house But there is something to be said about going home and going someplace where you're familiar. I enjoy traveling. And 
and likely I will continue, but there's a lot of things I gotta figure out first.